everybody, what's up? Carl Schuf here from snorkel.tv, and today I'm excited to welcome you to GSEP3 Express from Tweens to Timelines, all right? The goal of this course is for me to get beginners up and running quickly with the new GSEP3 API, all right? It's super exciting. The GSEP API is packed with features, but I'm gonna focus on the key ones that you as a beginner need to know to start making cool stuff really quickly, all right? I know there's people out there that can read release notes and documentation and kind of get a sense for what some code does, but it's my goal to show you not only how it works, but why it's important for your animation workflow. So I've got a series of really short videos, most like five to eight minutes in length. I've got interactive visualizers, demos, and handwritten instructions for you to actually get in there, see how this stuff works, experiment with it, and play with it on your own. We're gonna make some really fun stuff in just a short amount of time, and I'm gonna build the confidence that you need to go out there and make your own animations, all right? So I don't have a lot of time to make a super fancy marketing video, but what I'm gonna do is get off camera, and I'll just say a quick bunch of bullet points that sound impressive so that you'll take the course, all right? See you inside. All right, here we go. GSAP is used on over 8.5 million sites. It's used on a majority of award-winning websites. It's the best animation engine for HTML5 banners. It works on DOM elements, Canvas, SVG, and Animate CC2. It's been battle-tested for over a decade. It's got professional features, but it's beginner-friendly. Listen, it's awesome. Let me show you how to use it. If you want more free videos, be sure to subscribe to the channel as I regularly upload more tips and tricks. Hey look, this video in the corner is just for you. Check it out.